Hey guys, it's been a week since I've announced the US tour I'm doing in one month in September. I don't know what to expect. I have never done anything like this before. I've never done a sprawling tour like this. I'm hitting the West Coast, the East Coast, uh, parts of the center and the south of the country. The tour is promoting my new EP and the EP, just like this tour, is completely solo. It's just me my guitar, my harmonica, and my voice. As a musician, it can be a liberating thing, but it can be a terrifying thing to not have the, the, the safety net and the support of a band on stage with you. So this is gonna be a new thing for me. I'm, I have no idea what to expect. And uh, to commemorate this solo record and this solo tour, I'm gonna be doing this vlog where I document the behind the scenes, talk to you about my process, what's going on, we'll see how it goes. And for this first video, I'll tell you a little bit about what's gone into the planning process of this tour. I booked the tour and I'm promoting the tour independently. I don't work with a record label, so there's been a lot of man hours spent. A little bit about the way it works booking a tour independently is slogging through a bunch of what I call cold call emails. You hit up a bajillion music venues. You don't get a response from a lot of places, but you do, statistically speaking, you'll eventually get a handful of positive responses and then you negotiate terms and you do this for every city that you perform in. So that was quite a bit of work, but well worth it. I'm very stoked for many, many of the venues on this tour. And aside from that, there's just a bunch of um, legwork that goes into promotion too. At this point, I'm reaching out to local press, blogs, newspapers, radio stations, and we'll see who gets back to me. That's kind of the name of the game when you're at the stage that I'm at, is all DIY, you, you throw everything at the wall, see what sticks. Anyway, that's where I'm at these days. I'm gonna be doing more of these kinds of deep dive videos about what I'm up to as a musician, as an artist, as an independent artist. And I hope that these videos can allow us to connect more. It's really hard being a musician and you work your tail off and sometimes you feel fucking great about it. It feels like a noble pursuit. And other days you're left feeling despair. These are all honest parts of the journey of pursuing music as a livelihood. And I think you guys should know about it. And I just want to share my story with you guys. I will see you guys next week for another one of these deep dives. Cheers.